Dear friends, welcome back to Trust Proactive. In this video, we are going to be discussing how you can easily identify if a MAC address is Unima and Unicast, Multicast, or Broadcast. In our previous video about MAC address, we discussed about how to get in touch with that, but I want to solve more examples on that. Now, a MAC address it consists of 48 bit and or 6 bytes, right? And if you look at it, we discuss about the bottom part that means this first eight bit is the most important target in which we can use in identifying if a mac address is unicast multicast or uh unicast multicast because broadcast in general is just fixed but in this case we, will be, we are just specifically discussing on unicast and multicast just look at this first bit uh, this first byte which consists of 8 bit if we zoom out or uh, we zoom in better we can see that as we discussed previously that it consists of 8 bit this is the most significant bit and this is the word least significant bit if p naught is 0 it is unicast if p naught is 1 it is multicast let's try that same principle here our main target is this and as you can see here in this one the first one this first byte is actually 4a so we say that what 4a and the 4a means that it is in base 16 because we are having 4a here which is base 16 so what we need to note here is that there's some kind of a trick we can use we know in base 16 we can only have from 0 to 15 so by having 8 4 2 1 by adding them up 8 plus 4 will give us 12 plus 3 it gives us 15 so we need to target the 4 first right we need to find where the 4 would be. If we make 4 1, so 1 times 4 will definitely give us 4, right? So it's kind of we are turning it on, and the rest we don't need them, we switch it off. The next one is A. A is what? 10, which means we need to switch it on and switch to on. The rest we switch it off. And at the end, we have what? 0. We have, um, let me use another color. We have 0, 1, 0, 0. 1 0 1 0 and as you can see it is ending with 0 which means unicast so this one is actually unicast as it is ending with 0 let's see another example the next one is actually 0 8 so we come up with the 0 8 right what i done the 0 what are the 8 right there's no need of even stressing out we can just see we pick it up as eight four two one right so we turn this one on making the rest zero as you can see the last digit here is what zero it means this one is also what unicast right let's look at this this one is 54 right and as this one is 54 i can split it up as eight four two one i get my five down i get my four down i just need to switch one and one the rest zero and i also need to switch this one on and the rest zero so at the end of the day we are going to be having zero one zero one zero one zero one zero zero ending with zero uni cast so let's proceed more the next one is zero one zero zero five e right we just get zero one it is Four two eight one. We just need to turn this one on. The rest will be zero. So in that case, it is ending with what one? It is what multicast, right? Last one is broadcast. There's no need of applying any shortcut or checking if what it is actually. By looking at it, you'll be able to dictate the broadcast because FF signifies fifteen, right? And um, if FF signifies 15 it means 8421 we have to turn everything on so which means it cons consists of one one once 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 throughout right so it broadcast consists of one and so on so it's just in general it is constant right look at it this way just the way broadcast is but the unicast and broadcast you can check them through this format and identify if an address is a mac address or uh, it's a unicast mac address or a multicast if it's a unicast that is kind of personally your computer 
like one of them here is actually my PC's MAC address, right? You can see that it is personal, it is unicast, multicast kind of if it is a part of a group of computer or a network. I hope the, um, the idea is clear, right? See you later, guys.